about Xbox Game Pass, about Xbox Game Pass. Uh, Xbox Game Pass, like, my, uh, where is, how do I, how do I find, find this again? Uh, I think it's like settings, and then, yes. Yeah, here it is. A system. System. And then storage devices. Here it is. So, when you, when you bought, like, a literal hard drive just for Game Pass games, and you're like, oh, you're going to install all these Game Pass games to the, to the hard drive, the extra hard drive, but then you figure out, like, okay. All these games, you can play all these games, right? Pretty much. Uh, but then you, you scroll down and then suddenly... Oh, what's that? So you click that and then it's like, oh no, you can't play this game anymore. I'm like, what? You downloaded it? Like... Um... You downloaded the game, let's just say, two weeks ago, and now you can't play it anymore. Even though you have downloaded the game to the actual hard drive. Like, let's say... Here's one. Here's uh Okay, so let's just say this is the hard drive, right? You have downloaded the game to this thing right here. And now you can't play the game even though you downloaded the game. So um oh, I have to do it again. I think so. Um Yes, like you can like see, there's the drive, it used to be, I think it used to be like, yeah it used to be 99, but then I have had to remove some games because, uh, because, as I just pretty much showed, the game got removed, so there's the game. The game is on the hard drive. It's on the physical hard drive. It's still on the hard drive. So, what they actually have done is they've removed the game that you downloaded. Even though you've paid, you you pay a monthly fee to download. You pretty much you pay a monthly fee, and then you get these games for free. Even though it's not for free, you pay. To get those these games but uh so you have that game on the hard drive but you can't play it anymore even though it's already on the hard drive so it's like they have it's like they have like a code see here's the code right here's the code so they have they have a code and then they just remove that code and now you can't play that game anymore even though it's on the physical drive. So that's kind of a scam. You know, it, it's kind of like, oh, come on. Like, okay. So, so now I have to buy that game, even though I have downloaded it, on the hard drive. It's on there. Like, it's on that. But now they have removed it from the service. They've removed the code, they've removed that code, so I have to buy the game again, even though I've already downloaded it, downloaded it on the drive, it's already on there, but they've done that, so it's, yeah, maybe, 
it's uh it's uh, like yeah i mean are you gonna replay all these games though it's one of those things like but okay but you have downloaded the game so you should be able to have the game as long as the hard drive at least works as long as this still works you should be able to play the game because you downloaded the game right so well, what's the problem right but they want to earn extra money so now see now you have to buy the game again you know so you actually have to buy the game again or uh, or if they or if they somehow put the game back on game pass so it's like they you know so it's yeah if you're from an older generation you still buy physical games like you see that it's a physical game you actually pretty much open it up and you see whatever so it's a physical game you still like because you you're from an older generation so you we we like uh we didn't have digital games we didn't digital games are how old are they now? Twelve years old. They're really, they're really new. Digital games are new. Every game used to be physical before, like whatever game. So before, in the past, you had every game physically. That's how you play a game. But now it's digital. And if you, ha if you have, but some games only get released digitally, so you can't even buy them physically. Like you can't actually buy them physically. So maybe it's actually, okay, let's go back to physical again. But for these small games, is that even worth it? Like, but you, yeah, when you're actually from, um, I mean, you see what I'm saying? Like, uh, you can't play that game anymore. You can't play it. Even though it's on the fucking, it's on the hard drive. So, that kind of sucks. I mean, so that's why. If they completely remove physical games, I don't, I mean, yeah, okay. But the thing is, is that you're still paying for the online service. Like, you're still paying. You're still paying to play online here yeah, on Xbox. You're still playing to play online, so. It kind of sucks that. So if you download a game that can just remove the game and you can't even play anymore. I, it wasn't like that even on 360. Uh, on Xbox 360, if you had the game on Xbox 360, if you had the game downloaded to the hard drive, you could play it. Even though they removed the game from the store, which they've done here. So that kind of sucks. I mean, you uh, know. So. But this game... I don't think it has a physical release, so it's one of those things like, come on, like, what are they doing? Like, okay. Uh, but yeah, it's like one of those things. Like, that's why if you can, if you can buy games physically, you still buy them physically. Cause, uh, that's the way, that's all you, like, that's, that's pretty much how it used to be. And you know that if they remove some of the games from the store, uh, you still have it physically, so you can still play it. Although not every game is has a physical release, but uh, at least it's like okay, you own the thing. So if they ever remove it or do some bullshit, like oh you can't you can't play this game anymore. Uh, if you have it physically, you have it physically. So yeah, like I don't know. Ask Microsoft, I guess. Ask them.